My name is Maribel and I'm a freshman. Constantly fighting, just there was no like positive solution to the fights I would get in. It would always end up with me getting sent to the district and me getting kicked out of school. Before the peer mediation program, my school environment was bad. There was fights like behind the lunch tables, at lunch, in the mornings, in the restrooms. She told us that it involved students going in to help other students. We were all in because we did believe that students helping other students was going to create a positive culture in our school. And by the end of the year, we definitely saw those results. My experience with getting kicked out of school and getting sent to a different school, and then like just my experience with like fights in, in, in general, that made me become a peer mediator. Maybe I could help other people and tell them how, how it's gonna be and if they continue to fight and continue to disrupt and just not care about school. So I wanted to become a peer mediator because like, I seen a lot of kids were scared. Um, just going to school or like talking about their problems because like they'd feel like they'd um, get in trouble if they spoke out. So I wanted to like somehow help them feel safe to come forward and talk to us. I had to get creative to implement the program at Foothill Middle School because I was the only one that was trained in, in ABCs of conflict. Um, as an administrator, I'm the only assistant principal um, there, and I had to come up with a way to recruit some students and teach them a couple of the lessons that were part of the program. So what I did is I took the peer mediators out during homeroom on Fridays for about 35 minutes where I would just sit down with them and go over some of the strategies that would be useful to use during peer mediations. The students really took to it. They gravitated towards those lessons because they were very interactive. By opening up to them as well, like letting them know that they're not the only ones, that I have probably been through it too, that I'm not gonna go tell anyone. And like, once I open up to them, they open up back. So that makes it a lot easier. It, it changed me a lot because I am no longer fighting. I worked on my temper. I learned how to cope with other people and I learned that I'm not always gonna agree with other people. And it just changed me because I feel like I'm a better person and I'm not as a threat as what they said I was. I'm not a threat anymore and I'm actually doing better in school because I'm not worrying about what other people say or what they think or how they feel about me. more students are coming forward to like the principal or vice principal and like talking about their problems and they feel like they have someone they can talk to. I think peer mediation programs are very important in schools right now because there's a disconnect between the adults and the kids right now. Living through the COVID-19 pandemic and the school closures, we know that students are experiencing something different than what we adults are. And one of the things that students can tell each other is what their own experiences are. I give it a try and it has really helped me in life, so it could really help them too. It'll help them just be a better person like it helped me.